I don't know what the problem is. I decided to write a love story, but it's not working out. My hero sounds more like a clothing store dummy than a real life human being, and from what I hear, editors aren't fond of black mustachioed figures nowadays. I've been fighting with him for a week now. The stubborn mule, he, he won't make love to my heroine. He refuses. I, I've tried putting red blood in his veins, but the two of them just won't get together. They're as far apart as they were the day I sat down to write. I, I'm at my wit's end. I've bitten off nearly half my fingernails. Look, see? There's nothing wrong with my heroine. I I'm sure of that. She's a fascinating, mysterious, graceful creature full of wit and passion and adventure. But not once has he clasped him to her fiercely or pressed his lips to her hair, her eyes, her cheeks. He hasn't even had the guts to devour her with his eyes, as we writers like to say. This morning, I thought he might be developing real possibilities, but nothing came of it. He wimped out. That's why I decided to wash my hair and come out here to get away from him for a little while. Back home, I taught school and hated it. But I kept on teaching until I'd earned $500 for New York. I've been here six months now, and if I don't break into the magazine soon, I can write. I'm going to make it. I'm going to make this town count me in as the four million and one. -th. Sometimes I get so tired of being nobody at all that I just want to stand out by the curb and shout, Hey, you four million self-absorbed, uncaring people. I'm Mary Louise Moss from Escanaba, Michigan. And I like your town. And I want to stay here. Won't you please pay some attention to me? Just a little bit. Excuse me. Excuse me? What's going on here? I just heard my flight's been canceled, and that's really not going to work for me. Yeah, yeah, I can see. So this is what it comes down to then? How much is the car if I return it in Colorado? Fantastic. Hello, everyone. I have just been informed that there will be no more flights until tomorrow. I have one of the very last rental cars available. I am driving to Colorado Springs tonight. I have three seats available in the car and I am leaving in five minutes. If anyone wants to come along and split the costs, I'll be waiting over by the doorway. Yep, I'm smart. Real genius.